Hi, my name is Sophia, and my sign name, Sophia. Some of you may have seen me on play school and wished that you knew some of the signs that I do on the show. Well, it's very easy to teach yourself and your baby how to sign, and you can start straight away. This is a sign for ball. 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 And how about teddy? Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you. Let's see you like this. Thank you. Can you do that? It's, um, there. Aeroplane. You've probably noticed the sign that all babies use, pointing. When they're very little, it becomes an all-purpose sign that can mean many different things. Up. Down, take me over there, look, the give me. Yeah, that's a lion. Yeah. And that's Chances are you've already been communicating with your baby in gestures. Okay. Even only learning a few more signs will make a big difference in communicating with your baby because it gives them the opportunity to be more specific about what they want. Milk, more, Finished. Teddy. Play. Sleep. Cuddle. That pretty much covers their favourite vocab when they're very young. I have about 150 signs on this DVD, but you don't have to do them all at once. The first section is made up of very simple signs that you can start using with your baby as early as you like. And then later on, you have some more complicated signs for when they're older. Orange. Orange. Dragon, you came us. For my birthday party, I'm going to the aquarium. We've grouped the signs into chapters so you can find them easily. And I've linked together the thing that your child might be interested in. And also given you a sign for everyday business with your child. I've also included nursery rhyme. Just for fun. I've included tips from parents who've already taught their children to sign, so you can get an idea of how they did it. And really all I did was, whenever I'd breastfeed her, I'd show her the sign and then I'd feed her um, and kind of, you know, talk to her and make the sign several times. We started out just with one sign and within a couple of months she started to respond to that. So it was really exciting. A lot of parents say it reduces frustration to be able to communicate with pre-verbal children and by learning particular signs and teaching them with your child, sometimes it just makes the parent more aware of the gesture. Their child might already naturally be using gestures, but the parent might not be aware of it or not, not actually learning the child's gestures. So this way they have a common language base uh, for their gestures, a common basis. Oh, oh that's a big gorilla. Hey, how does a gorilla go? Hey. <laughs> like that, yeah. <laughs> That's right. I'll also be showing you numbers. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Blast off. <laughs>
The alphabet? A... B... C. And colours? My favourite colour is the rainbow red, blue, pink, yellow, purple, orange and green. Mm.